Hello and welcome to The Tasting Couch. My name is Will. The Tasting Couch is a comfortable place where you can relax and enjoy fine spirits from around the world. Today we're tasting Saint Germain. The couch, it's a love sack sectional in Venetian taupe. Let's go to France. Saint Germain elderflower liqueur. Did you know that there are over 1,000 hand-picked elderflowers in each bottle and that they can only be picked once a year? Let's take a look at the bottle and the liquid. This is a very attractive, tall, art deco, clear, heavy glass bottle. The paper label is subtle, yet elegant. There's a lot of attention to detail on this label. Each bottle is numbered with the year the elderflowers were collected. The top is a plastic twist-off cap. It's got their logo on the top. What does the juice look like? It's a bright, beautiful yellow gold color. The legs are thick and coat the glass. Then long legs start to develop. On the nose, the aroma, what do we smell? It's very unique. First you get big flowery notes, very spring-like scents. Then grape notes and citrus fruits, grapefruit and lemon. It's very fresh, wow. Let's taste. Santé. It has a bright floral taste, followed by honeysuckle and fresh pear and grapefruit and lemon. I also get sweet notes. Like pineapple and lychee. There's no heat. This is only 40 proof. The mouthfeel is sweet and velvety, and on the finish, it's long with a very light, elegant, floral, but very natural finish. The history in the process. This was created by Robert Cooper, a third generation distiller, the son of Norton Cooper, who has created some very popular spirit brands himself. It was launched in 2007, inspired by the Saint Germain de Paris iconic quarter in Paris. Later that year, it won best of show in the San Francisco World Spirits competition, and the brand became popular instantly. In 2013, the brand sold to Bacardi, yet Robert agreed to stay on and keep working with the brand. In 2016, Robert passed away at the young age of 39. Year after year, the brand continues to grow in both popularity and sales. The process, fresh, wild elderflower blossoms are hand-picked every spring. Only the freshest elderflowers are used in this liqueur. They are picked at peak freshness, which is a short three-week period in late May. They are picked in the early morning when the temperatures are cooler, and the flowers are just opening. A time when the aroma and the flavor of the blossoms are at their peak. Only the highest quality blossoms are used. Often they are transported by bicycle as not to bruise them. Up to 1,000 carefully selected flowers are used in every bottle. They are macerated, extracting the maximum flavor without getting any of the bitterness. Finally, a French master of botanicals combines them with a grape eau de vie in a very top secret process. How do I drink it? It's nice straight up or on the rocks. It's amazing with champagne. It's very mixable and can add sweetness without being overly sweet. I have had some incredible cocktails with this. One of my favorites is the Saint Germain Spritz. It's super easy to make. In a tall glass filled with ice, add one and a half ounces of St. Germain, two ounces of Prosecco, and two ounces of club soda. Gently stir, garnish with a lemon or an elderflower. 
you got any value out of this, please hit the like button and subscribe and follow us on Instagram at The Tasting Couch. If you've made it to here, thank you for that. But that's the show. This is a French liqueur you will want to have in your home. Go out and buy a bottle at your local liquor store or order one online. I'll put a link below. Santé.